Hey there, this is Kat again. This time I'm going to do a flip cut. I'm still not convinced about coconut milk serum, but so far I'm liking it. Today it rained and stormed and thundered all day. And my little dog, Roxy, spent most of her time running in and out of my bedroom. She has to dig herself under my covers. And I've made my bed up like six times, maybe more. Because she will find her way under those covers. Anyway, let's get started. Uh, this was a canvas I did not like too dark. So I'm covering over it. And the paint was too thin because it came off on the sides. I'm going to do a drag. Yeah. I'm going to drag this baby. Okay. Put a little white in. And let's go with some purple. It's all deco art. Flow trawl. A little Elmer's glue. You can see the colors. I don't need to describe them. Okay, that's still good. I only, I did not put silicone in this. I just opened it up after about a week. Because this, you got to be careful with this uh, treadmill. I mean, what am I thinking? I just watched a video and the person used treadmill. The coconut milk serum. Treadmill's the only thing I have not tried. And I've got spray silicone. I've got 100% body silicone. That's all I'm going to call it. Dimethicone. I know it's hard for you to see. My The sun hasn't completely gone down. So... I've got all my lights on, but I, the main one is reflecting. These look like bright, vibrant colors, and I'm hoping they come out that way. But sometimes you can't dictate what's going to happen. You know, I've gotten to enjoy making these videos. And I always forget my rag, but not this time. I've got it. Some of you may be screaming, why are you doing that to that picture? It looks so good because it's too dark, too much brown. That's my answer, and I'm sticking to it. Oh, 
Okay, I don't want any more paint because it's going to be a flip and drag. So, full cup on an 8 by 10 and this is a 3 ounce cup would be disastrous because it would take the paint that I mixed and poured would completely take over one two and that's what I see everybody doing but my stick sells up really nice look at that If only my painting does that, I will be so happy. My sticks always sell up, though. Okay, we're going to flip this. Now I'm going to put down a lot of white. People have said that I should gesso, but you know, if any of the colors come through, that's okay. I don't care. I've cleaned it. So if they come through, that's good. I mixed this quite a while back and I didn't like the outcome but I'm giving it another try because it I've sat let it sit open because I think I had too much water in it I just did not like the way it was reacting. And it's deco art. But I found, being here in Cleveland, Ohio, it's so humid, and I'm right up against the lake, Lake Erie, that water does not work in my paintings very well. And today is no exception with all this rain. I have my doors open. I'm not ready to turn the air conditioner on to take this humidity out yet. So if you hear anything, it's my neighbors. I got way too much white. So I'm going to make sure that all the edges are covered. I did a painting before this and had leftover paint. This paint, this is, paint is still running. Bummer. Guess I gotta leave it out again.
Okay. I don't know what that side looks like. I just hope I got it. I really should put a mirror back there. Okay, we're going to give this a try. My torch bit the dust, and I got it last month, but at least I can get a refund because Amazon guaranteed it. Okay. Do I want to heat it, heat it with my heat gun? Yeah. Okay, all the cells that are going to come up have come in, have come up. That didn't do any good. And because my white was too thin, now I'm going to have to make sure I've got the whole canvas covered. But I like the colors. Okay, I'm trying to pick up some white to dump in these bare areas so I don't have to get rid of all my uh, cells. I know I'm being picky, but That's okay. We can afford to be picky. Okay, I think that's it. Yeah, that looks... Wait a minute. I was wrong. I guess I'm blind. Okay, we're going to tilt. Because of the bare spots, I'm losing my cell formation. Maybe if I can tilt it just right. The only black that came up is on your right hand side.
see if I can get the shapes back. Some of them look, are going to look like a river ran through it. Hey, that's a good name. These are all places where the uh, light got funky on me. It's been an awful long time since I even messed with that paint. And there's still a problem, I guess. I'll do one more painting with it after it sits out for a while. And if it doesn't act right, I guess I'll be throwing it out. I'm going to move it to where that black is more centered. I don't like it off set like that. And I want to make sure I got all my corners. Got really good neighbors. Young people on both sides. Okay, let's move this block. This does not want to move. It's moving, but that white is like drying up super fast. It'll help it pour. Uh-oh, got a goober in it. Nope, it was an air bubble. It 
everything's moving but that black. I practically lost all my cells. They look like jellyfish. This is taking a lot longer than I expected. I guess you can't expect anything until the painting is done. I like the way the colors have mingled together. It's not too light. If I can just get this area here to center more because there's not much happening in each of the other corners. I got some jumbo push pins through Staples. I went in and they didn't have them on the shelf, so I ordered them and got free shipping. So under $4, I got 12 of these monster push pins. And all I wanted was one. To bust a cut. It's moving, but it's taking its sweet old time. Give it a little more of a tilt. This is so boring, isn't it? I should have music in the background. It's almost there. I keep finding things in the paint. Well, the paint's coming off the end over here. So, I guess it's still moving. I don't like the way it's going sideways, though. It's like one black cloud in the middle Lavender stuff. I wanted enough to put a small 8x10 canvas, no, 8x10 picture frame, and it's not going to happen.
I like more of the solid colors here. But I can't get no more to run off. And my cells are totally gone. I have totally maneuvered them out of the picture. I got cells going on here. I think I'll try a black next. I'm trying to keep the picture in frame. Because I'm worrying about this one little corner. But I shouldn't. Because most of it looks like this. Okay, gang. That's about all I can do. I've lost my cells. I think I have five. I'm going to try the heat gun again. Even though it didn't work the first time. Okay, well, thank you for joining me. Oh, I got some white cells coming up. But I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it wasn't too boring. Hit the like button. And subscribe, hit the bell, and share it. I would like to have a hundred views on any of my videos because I'm not getting out there and I sure would appreciate it. You all out there are great people. I have not found one negative person that does a dirty pour with acrylics. Or the whole acrylic gang. Thumbs up, Audrey. I hope you're doing well. Audrey's my friend in Scotland. And I told her I would mention. Because she watches every one of my videos. Even though she gave up acrylic painting a long time ago. Anyway, bye-bye. Have a nice evening.